So this is a wine from uh, Jerez, from Sherry, it's south of Spain. So this one is made by uh, González Bayas, which is his famous Tio Pepe. But on this case it's an Una Palma, which means six years aging on the Solera, which um, gives much more um, complexity, it's like an extra flavor to it. And it's perfect to combine with seafood because it's like the uh, territorial combination between the fino Sherry and seafood. And it, it always a very good wine to start with, to finish or to eat with. This is a wine from uh, Rioja, uh, from Aro village, which is one of the most famous villages in Rioja. This is a wine from uh, Lope de Heredia Viña Tondonia, which is one of the most classic and traditional uh, wineries in, in, in Rioja. This is a beautiful 1995 vintage, uh, which is a great vintage in Rioja. So they used to release his Gran Roseba with at least 20 years, which is great because the wine is ready to drink. And regarding combinations, you can combine with a very classic meat from the region, such as lamb, looking for this um, combination between protein from the meat, tannins from the wine, that always is going to be very successful. This wine is made on Canary Islands, especially on the part of Tenerife, uh, which all the soil is volcanic, so that's why on the wines you always find this kind of volcanic expression from the soil, which is very interesting. And this is like a Jurassic part of local grapes. So this one, it's made by Ignios Borja Perez um, uh, wine grower. That on this case, he's using Baboso Negro to produce this wine, which is quite concentrate, powerful, intense, because it's the style of the region that it came. It's a very Canary Island style on the red side. And uh, regarding combinations, you can, you can use to uh, combine with a quite big piece of uh, beef because um, always these kind of powerful wines with powerful meats, they are always very successful and it really works.